In this tutorial we will take a look at the few node and electron modules to gather information about the user system, application and the screen. If we navigate to index.html we can see that we already displayed some of the system info by using node process module and outputting version of node, chrome and electron. Similarly, we can use another node module called OS, which will provide info about the operating system. Let's display our computer hostname from the render.js file. First, we will require OS package and assign it to the OS constant. We will print it out in the console, so let's write console.log. Add a string of home space dear colon as a parameter and call the os.hostname function. The Electron API also offers a module called App, which is responsible for controlling the application's lifecycle. We will display the application path value. Begin by requiring Electron package and getting the remote module out by using destructuring with curly brackets. We will use remote module to call app module, which is available only in the main process from our renderer process. Similar to displaying the OS host name, we will print out the application path in the console by running console.log, passing app space path colon as first parameter and calling the remote.app get app path function. The Electron screen module retrieves information about screen size, displays, cursor position, etc. We will use the screen module to gather information about the av available screen to work on and open new browser window with the work area width and height. Begin by navigating to index.html and adding a button with the ID of work-area-size and the text of create new window. Now let's navigate to the render.js file and get the reference to the button by calling document.getElementById with the parameter a string of work-area-size and assigning it to the work-area-size-btn constant. Now let's create a click event listener on that button reference. This can be done by calling the add event listener method on the work area size btn. And passing click string as a first parameter. An anonymous function with an event as a second parameter. To get the available work area size, we must require the electron package again and assign it to the electron constant. We cannot just define the screen constant because window.screen is a reserved property. Now, to get the available work area size, we can call the electron 
dot screen dot get primary display dot work area size inside the event listener and get the width and the height by destructuring the returned object. Our work area width and height sizes are available so we can use them to define new browser window width and height. We will create new browser window using the remote module because we are creating it from the renderer process. Define new block scoped variable win and assign new instance of browser window to it by calling the new remote dot browser window and providing width and height as a parameter in an object. We will display the GitHub website in our browser window, so we call the win.loadURL method and passing in the string of https github.com.